National Five Biology students join me to do this past paper question. So this one says the diagram relates to reproduction in humans. We have to name organ G. So let's have a look. Organ G is the organ that produces eggs. So hopefully we remember that in animals or humans, it is the ovary that produces the eggs. Okay, so we're putting down ovary here. Part B, describe what happens during fertilisation. Okay, so this is fertilisation here and we can see the egg and the sperm coming together to form this cell. So how do we describe that? Well, we say that we have the fusion of the nuclei, and you need to use these terms to get the mark here, from, now you could say the sperm and the egg, but I'm just going to put down our stock answer, which is the haploid gametes, okay, because that also covers plants then, as well as humans, okay, if we just said sperm and egg, then we're talking specifically about humans or animals. So the fusion of the nuclei from haploid gametes to form a cell called a diploid zygote. Okay, so that's the, the stock answer that you're looking for when you're asked about fertilization. If you can come up with that and you can memorize that, you're going to be absolutely fine. Okay, we have to name cell H. So cell H is the cell that's made as a result of fertilization. Now we actually already mentioned it up here, okay? So we mentioned that we produce a diploid zygote, okay? And as I, I always just put this in my definition for fertilization, even if it's not always needed, because again, it's given us the hint for the answer to the next question. So that's, that's great. And then part B, name the unspecialized cells that can be obtained from an embryo at a very early stage. Again, this is a knowledge-based one. Hopefully remember that the ones that we get from the embryo at a very early stage are embryonic. You don't get a mark for this, but we just put this in for completeness. The embryonic stem cells. Okay, so it's the stem cells part which gets you the mark there. Okay, folks, hope that helped. I'll see you in the next one.